To look back and say that I was involved in something that's been going for close to coming on 50 years is, is a brilliant thing and, and it made me the type of person I am today, which ended up making me a, a rugby league player. We'd moved over from Ipswich, it was a weird scenario. Mum and Dad decided that they wanted to live on Bribey Island near the coastline and they kind of said, if you're going to live at the beach, you need to have some beach awareness with the surf and things like that. So they took us down, um, signed us straight on. I remember getting the little, the cap and the, the budgie smugglers and thinking, how good's this? In under 12s, we run state relay. Uh, we had a little team there, there was about Six or seven of us working for four positions, um, which was great. It made it really competitive and probably why we were probably successful at such a young age. Uh, going down and uh, just training with the boys and having that kind of camaraderie that you, you get in team sports, but in an individual sport. It, it made me a better person, I feel. I, I feel I, um, I learned about accepting loss and victory humbly, um, which was great at a young age and it probably rubbed off on me in my rugby league career as well. But off season was a time to work for me, so even when I was 12, I played club footy, then I'd go do nippers. It was something that there was no rest for me. So when I finally made first grade, we'd, we'd have that eight week block where we're meant to rest, but I just couldn't, I had to do something, whether it was training, beach sessions, things like that. It, it was instilled at me at a young age, which I'm forever thankful for. I'm a game development officer up here on the Sunshine Coast. I, I go to schools and clubs and coach the skills of rugby league that makes you a good person. But on the flip side, because we partner with the Moolabar Cert Club, we, um, we do a lot of talks about personal branding, healthy living, drug and alcohol awareness with the local police, um, messages that are gonna make them better people rather than better football players. And um, as much as I didn't realise how rewarding it would be, it is great. You, you see parents come up to you, thank you for as simple as a little half an hour talk about how important it is to be a good person or guys don't do these sort of things. Um, it, it's a great job and I can get to say I can do it on a daily basis with a background like this behind me. It's not a bad office, is it? No, not a bad office at all. Kids should definitely get involved in nippers in every way. For one, uh, you make lifelong friendships. Um, you learn some of the greatest skills in life. You need to know, especially if you live near the beach, how to get out of a, a rip and things like that. And, I think it's just a great way to, I guess, build a person and build a character. Is down on the beach, you work hard, you come off, you have good times and good friends. So I, I'd say get involved as much as you can.